Are you looking for some family-friendly Halloween movies to watch this spooky season? Well, today I have a list of 30 for you and where you can watch them. Let's get into it. I'm Pamela, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Sister Pam Spook Fest 2024. So obviously I am a big fan of horror movies, but I'm also a fan of some feel good children's Halloween movies. Halloween has always been my favorite season ever since I was a kid. So there are several Halloween movies from my childhood that I still rewatch every single Halloween season. And I figured I would share some of them with you today. These aren't really in any particular order. I didn't rank them or anything. This is just a randomized list. So first up, starting off strong, we have Hocus Pocus. This one is probably actually my favorite Halloween movie. I rewatched this one like 30 times during spooky season. This one is a classic. If you have not seen this one yet, or if your kids have not seen this one yet, it is a must watch. You need to make a movie night out of it, make some snacks, get cozy, and this is just a guaranteed good watch. You will not be disappointed with this movie. And you can watch this one on Disney+. Plus, Which also brings me to Hocus Pocus 2. This is the sequel that came out, I think, two years ago. Maybe it was last year, I honestly can't remember. But it took them about 30 years to make this sequel. And I will admit, it's nowhere near as good as the original, but it's still an okay watch, especially for your kids today who didn't really grow up with the nostalgia of the first one. I'm sure they'll appreciate it. There are certain parts about this sequel that I do enjoy, and this one is on Disney Plus as well. Next up, we have Halloween Town. This one is actually kind of tied for first place with Hocus Pocus for me. Halloween Town is, always has been one of my favorites since I was a kid. Debbie Reynolds is in this one. If your kids have not seen this, they are guaranteed to enjoy this one. You will not be disappointed. This one is also on Disney Plus, which brings me to all of the sequels. We have Halloween Town 2, Halloween Town 3, and Halloween Town 4. This entire franchise has always been my favorite ever since I was a kid. There really isn't a bad movie in the franchise. The fourth one did recast the main actress, which is kind of a bummer, but she still did a great job, the newer actress, and it's still a solid sequel. So all of these are on Disney+. Plus. Our seventh movie on this list is Mary-Kate and Ashley, Double Double Toil and Trouble. This is one that I loved as a kid, but I honestly have not re-watched it since I was a kid. Because every year, this one isn't free on any of the streaming services. If you wanna watch this one, you'll have to rent it on YouTube or Amazon Prime. It's probably like $3.99, so not too expensive, but every year when I see that I have to rent it, I'm like, ugh, there's so many other movies I could watch instead. I'm gonna skip this one for now, but maybe this year is the year that I give it a rewatch. Our eighth movie on the list is Twitches. This is another Disney Channel original movie starring Tia and Tamara Maori. I was absolutely obsessed with this movie as a kid. It's so much fun. They play twin witches who were separated at birth and their birthday is on Halloween. And when they meet at 21 years old, they discover that they're witches. This one is also available to watch on Disney+, Plus, which brings me to our ninth movie, Twitches 2, the sequel. Not as good as the original, but still a great watch. I rewatch the first one and second one every spooky season. Our 10th movie on the list is Ernest Scared Stupid. This one is available to rent on Amazon Prime, which I actually did just the other night. This is not a movie that I grew up watching. I never watched it as a kid. Someone recently told me about it and I gave it my first time watch as an adult. And I'll admit I didn't really care for this movie. I wasn't crazy about it. But obviously I am not the target audience. <laughs> and sometimes when you don't watch a movie as a kid, it doesn't have that nostalgia factor for you when you're older. So that's probably why I didn't enjoy it that much. But you know, it was a fun movie. Obviously if you have kids, they will definitely enjoy this movie. Movie number 11 is Mom's Got a Date with a Vampire. This is another one that I was absolutely obsessed with as a kid. I just rewatched it the other day. It still holds up. This one is also available on Disney+. Plus. So far, most of the movies on this list are all on Disney+. Plus. So if you have kids, chances are you already have Disney+. Plus. So there are tons of Halloween movies on there for you guys to watch. 
Next up we have Don't Look Under the Bed, another Disney Channel original movie. Another one that I've been obsessed with since I was a kid, I rewatch it every year, still holds up. It is a kids movie and family friendly, but I will admit, it can be a little scary. I was very young when I first watched it and it scared me as a kid, so I guess you kind of have to determine if your kids can handle it or not. There are quite a few scenes that can be a little scary, but it's still family friendly, so maybe give it a shot. And this one is also on Disney+. Plus. Next up, we have Phantom of the Megaplex, another Disney Channel original movie that I was obsessed with as a kid. Just gave it a rewatch the other day, still holds up. Next up, we have The Addams Family. This is a classic. I'm sure most of you watching this have seen it before. Had to add it to the list. This one is on Paramount+. Plus. Our 15th movie on the list is Casper, another movie starring Christina Ricci who plays Wednesday in The Addams Family. I loved Casper as a kid, still rewatch it every year. This one is currently available to watch in a few different places. You can watch it on Peacock, Amazon Prime, or Hulu Premium. Which brings me to number 16, Casper Meets Wendy. This is the one that stars Hilary Duff. This might have been her first movie ever, honestly. She was very young in this movie. This is another one that was absolutely one of my favorites as a kid. This one I don't think is available anywhere. You might have to rent it or it might be free on YouTube, but it's probably a bad quality one. I remember last year I found it on YouTube for free, but it was kind of blurry, but I'm sure you could rent this somewhere. Number 17, we have Goosebumps from 2015. This is the one that stars Jack Black. I honestly am not sure if I ever actually seen this one. But I am a fan of the original Goosebumps show, so I might have to give this one a watch this spooky season. And this one is available on Amazon Prime. Next up, we have the movie Now You See It. I was obsessed with this movie as a kid. It is a Disney Channel original movie. I don't think it's really Halloween themed, like it doesn't take place on Halloween, but it involves magic. It's pretty spooky, so definitely a good watch for the Halloween season and you can watch it on Disney+. Plus. Next up, we have The Haunted Mansion. This is the one that stars Eddie Murphy. I absolutely love this movie as a kid, still do to this day. I rewatch it every year. This one is just a lot of fun, and you can watch this one on Disney+. Plus. Our 20th movie on the list, we of course have to include It's the Great Pumpkin, Charlie Brown. Just a classic that I'm sure all of you watching this used to watch it as a kid. Unfortunately, this is like not streaming anywhere besides Apple TV. You can't rent it on Amazon Prime. It doesn't play on cable anymore. You can only watch it if you have Apple TV. Next up, we have Scooby-Doo and the Witch's Ghost. This is another one that I was obsessed with as a kid, and I just currently re-watched it for the first time since I was a kid. Every single spooky season, I go to watch it, and it was never free anywhere. I would have had to rent it, so I always like pass up on the chance to watch it. But this year, it's on HBO Max. So I did just watch it the other day and still holds up. Great movie. Your kids will love this one. Which brings me to number 22, Scooby-Doo Zombie Island. As a kid, I had this one on VHS and I honestly used to watch it like every day. I was so obsessed with this one. This one is also currently on HBO Max. Maybe you and your kids can do a double feature one night and watch both of these movies back to back. Next up, we have the original Ghostbusters. This is just another classic, so good. They really don't make movies like this anymore. This one is currently available in several different locations. You can watch it on Stars, YouTube Premium, Hulu Premium, or Amazon Premium. Also, this is one of those that's like always on cable during spooky season, like on Freeform. So if you have Freeform on cable, you can probably download the Freeform app and connect your cable through that and stream it there. Next up, we have Coraline. Another great movie, but this is also another one that might be a little scary for your kids. Like if they're super young or if they're just really sensitive to scary things, this one might be a little scary but still family friendly. So if your kid is kind of into more scarier stuff, they will absolutely love this movie. Currently, it's only available on Pluto TV, which is free. 
but I feel like it might go to other streaming services as we go further into spooky season. I feel like last year it was on HBO Max, but right now it's free on Pluto. Next up, we have Muppets Haunted Mansion. I think this movie is fairly new. I think it came out like three years ago. I watched it last year for the first time and I thought it was really enjoyable, especially if you're a fan of the original Haunted Mansion with Eddie Murphy. This one is a lot of fun. I always love the Muppet interpretation on things. This one is on Disney Plus as well. Next up, we have Monster House. This is honestly such a great movie. I was obsessed with it as a kid, still am. In fact, I just got it on DVD recently. This one is honestly one of my absolute favorites for spooky season. It does take place on Halloween. And this one is available in a few different places. It's free on Amazon Prime, also free on Freebie, or you can rent it on YouTube. Our 27th movie on the list is Hoobie Halloween. This is a newer movie that has quickly become a classic for me. It's not super new, it did come out a few years ago, but mostly when I watch these like kids Halloween movies, they're much older movies that are more nostalgic for me than I watched as a kid. But this one I watched as an adult and it's honestly so funny. It is a Netflix original movie, so that is where you can watch it. It stars Adam Sandler and it's honestly just a lot of fun. You won't be disappointed. Our 28th movie is The Nightmare Before Christmas. This one's a classic. It's on Disney+. Plus. Our 29th movie is The Corpse Bride. This one is currently on HBO Max. And our 30th and final movie on the list is The Little Vampire. This is another one of my absolute favorites from when I was a kid. I used to watch it so much as a kid. I remember last year it wasn't available anywhere. I remember I had to rent it, but this year it is on Paramount Plus and Hulu Premium and Amazon Premium. This one is honestly just such a solid movie that still holds up today. And they did do a remake, an animated remake a few years ago, which I've never seen, but I guess you can add that one to this list as well. But there you have it. Those are 30 family-friendly Halloween movies that you can watch with the entire family this spooky season. Make a movie night out of it, make some snacks, get all cozy, decorate the house a little bit. Spooky season really is my favorite time of the year and you can make some good memories with your kids this year. Thank you so much for tuning into another video. Please give it a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel if you have not done so already. Hit that notification bell so that you don't miss out on future posts. And I will see you guys next time.